What's up everybody? And today we'll be unboxing the Legion of Collectors box. This is the DZ DC version, not DZ DC version. Um, I'm your host Kevin. This is Unboxing in Tunes. If you want to go check out my previous video of Unboxing in Tunes, which was the first video ever for unboxing, it was the Marvel's edition for Thor Ragnarok. That was this month's theme for Marvel. This month it is uh, DC's um, Justice League because the movie is about to come out soon. Uh, but without uh, further ado, let's go ahead and unbox this pretty thing. Alright, so let's get unboxing. I already ripped open the tape. Without further ado, let's get inside this awesome box and uh, see what's inside. Alright. There we go. So inside, it looks like we got a t shirt. Ooh, this shirt looks like it's gonna be popping. I'm gonna display all this towards the end of the video. It's a 2X, that's the size I am. I even got a straw. What's going on here? We got a straw. Uh, okay, straw. Oh, look at this pen. Look at this pen, man. That's Batman right there, man. So far, these pens have been on the point. What we got here? Let's see. Look like sticky notes. Yep, that's what this is, sticky notes. That's crazy. Now you already see the pops in here, so we'll get to the pops. But let's see what's in this box right here. Let's see what this thing is. All right, so let's see what we got here. Oh, if it's a straw, got a cup, right? Let's see what cup we got. We got a Wonder Woman cup. Not bad. I could definitely use this for work. Take the lid off. You know, it's just standard plastic cup. Not bad. It's nice and thick. Fungal pop to prove. Power Grace Wisdom. It's not bad. Nice little twisty. Put back on. So, not bad. The cup. Without further ado, let's get into the fungal. So, we'll bring out this guy right here, Steppenwolf. Now, I ain't gonna lie to you guys, I just started reading comic books 2016, so I really don't know uh, everybody's villains all that much, uh, but Steppenwolf, I think, is a um, Wonder Woman uh, person, villain. Uh, so, and as you can see, exclusive right here, DC exclusive. Can't get this anywhere else. So, how about we take him out of the box? And get a, a real good look at it. Oh, we got another card that came with it. But we'll worry about the card later. Here we go. Stepping with it. Yeah, closer look. Not bad. It's not a bobble head, as you can see in the inside. Uh, the paint job on this isn't bad, especially like his armor. And look at if you can get a detail of his hands. It looks like, you know, like he's about to grip something out the real nice and pointy. So, not bad, Steppenwolf. Not bad. Put him right here. Without uh, further ado, let's get to my man. Aquaman right here, man. Now, listen. A lot of people be disrespecting Aquaman. I just want to first and foremost say that this is the toughest man. Read your comic books. Now, DC Rebirth, he went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Superman. I don't want to hear nothing else. He went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Superman, gave Superman a run for his money. That's what Aquaman do. People say, oh, he just talked to fish in swimming water. No, no, no. He controls the fish, and he's real strong. So think of Superman just in the, o in the ocean. You know what I'm saying? And also exclusive. This you can't get in stores exclusive and what I meant to mention in the previous video with the Marvel unboxing you can't find these in stores you can't I don't care where you go you can't get this in stores now on the back of it I went to my, my uh, comic book store and he had Batman D 
the different version of Aquaman holding his staff, Wonder Woman, Superman, Flash, and Cyborg. So those you can get in stores, but whenever you see exclusive, that means you can't get it in stores. You can't go to Walmart, can't go anywhere. I mean, you might probably be able to buy it off of eBay. Somebody's selling it, but I know I'm not selling it. You know what I'm saying? So here we go, let's take him out. Oh, he also got a card. We'll check that out later. Take him out. Let's see what he worked with. Man, look at the detail of him, man. His hair, nice and curly. Also, not a bobblehead. It looks like he's just now coming out of the water. It looks like he's, you know, like it's freezing up, like like we saw in in one of the um, in one of the uh, commercials when he come out of the water and the water just splashing on him. Man, he look mad, fitting to be a showdown. Gonna fight? You gonna fight? What, what, what we doing? What we doing? Make a move! Make a move! All right, so I hope you guys liked it. Everything in this box was great and amazing. Uh, like I said, they're exclusive, so you can't find these in store. I mean, you might be able to find this cup in the store or when the movie comes out, maybe that movie theater might be giving this out, but then again, if it doesn't, it's exclusive. Uh, you could probably get this, um, you know, sticky note from Walmart or Target or whoever, but the fungal pops is definitely, you gotta subscribe. Now, the way you subscribe is, and I'll leave all that information in the, in the link down below, um, but you head over to them uh, and they have two subscriptions. You can either subscribe to be a, an annual subscription where you're paying 150 but it's for the whole year. And on your anniversary month, not only do you get that month's box, but you also get uh, something, uh, I think, either added into the box or you get a, a, another box separate, but it's special. Uh, or you can be like me, who really don't have 150 to just give out. Uh, and you're just paying every other month for the bi-monthly box, and it's only $25. Uh, plus shipping handling, which will bring you to $31.95. Everything that's inside the box is a value of 50 bucks, and I can understand that. I mean, it's not like you can find this pen anywhere. Like, I don't know where you can find that at. These fungal pops, you can't get them anywhere. I mean, it's fungal pops. Like, look, look at it. Uh, and this t shirt. I don't see this in Walmart or Target or whoever. So, like I said, it's, it's very exclusive. Um, these are not. This is not the only video I've done. I did a previous unboxing in tunes of the Marvel edition. You can definitely go check that out on my channel. Please like and subscribe. I also talk about motorcycles and how to get into that world. Uh, but during this time of the season, I I haven't gotten into it because well. It's, it's starting to get cold outside. I also uh, do my Kev's Weekly Pool where I go to my comic book store, I show what's new on the rack, and show you what I pulled off the rack, and we rant and talk about whatever is going on within that day or about the comics. And I also do Kev's uh, or Intune's Hop-In Edition where I talk about certain comic books that I feel as though not a lot of people are talking about that much. And I go ahead and give you a slightly little review, uh, give you enough juice to make you want to go and go pick up that book and try it out for yourself. Uh, but I always end each and every video with, I've been Kev, you've been you, let's stay in tune.